Why, hello there, crazy fools. I'm Random Ross, and this is a random review, and today I'm reviewing Rocky Free or Rocky T. So, this again is written, directed by, and starring again Sylvester Stallone with the regulars. You know, Sylvester Stallone starring him, Tilda. But T Talia Shire, Carl Weathers, Burgess Meredith, with newcomer Mr. T, who this I believe was just before the A Team, and you know, but yeah, this time Rocky is facing against him in this third installment in the Rocky franchise. So after you know the first two movies focused on you know Rocky facing you know um, Apollo Creed. You know, in those five years, Rocky has gone on to become a successful boxer. He's, you know, become famous. And, um, you know, this time in the ring, he's facing against Mr. T. And in this one, this is where the soundtrack for the film was Eye of the Tiger by Survivor and has gone on to be, you know, completely, you know, become part of the, not just Rocky Free, but probably the whole series soundtrack. Or at least just the third film. Um, so, yeah, to be honest, I do think that is a bit of an overplayed song, Eye of the Tiger, but it's still a good one for this movie. Uh, so, what did I like about this one? Well, again, I liked how the ante was upped, how the drama was upped, how the, you know, the budget was, how, you know, Sylvester Stallone played Rocky in his performance, how Carl Weathers... I liked the friendship that, you know, Rocky and Apollo formed in this one, becoming buddies, and, you know working out and training amongst each other and you know just you know doing that being good friends i like their friendship in the movie and probably the friendship they had in real life as i am assuming because you know this is like the third time around they've done a movie together uh, also you know our supporting acts in this are great as well and mr t he puts up an intimidating performance i can't actually remember his character's name now it's just slipped my mind but he is a mean badass in this, and it's like, you you don't like this guy, but you're not supposed to like him, because he's like meant to be like, you know, we're meant to be rooting against him. You know, we're, we're all rooting for Rocky, and, you know, he then comes across contending against him. But yeah, this is still a great sequel, and I will say it's probably better than the first two altogether. It's just an entertainer. I'm entertained throughout. I, I can't get enough of this one. It's one of the best sequels. At least drama sports sequels are concerned. And, you know, I didn't think they could top it. But, yeah, we get, we get the fourth movie in time. But, Rocky Free, it's still an entertaining one. And I will probably say the last one before the series started to get a bit... Eh, maybe before it started to... Well, no. I wouldn't say Rocky 4 was a cash grab or, or Rocky 5, but let's just say this was one of the, the top sequels. When, when the franchise was in full bloom and was fully going, and when everyone was loving it, and when Rocky was, you know, just... And we get, like, the montages again, the training workout montages, where Rocky has to, you know, first face himself, his physical health and that. But, you know, it all gets... You know, in the build up to him fighting T. So, uh, Rocky Free, what am I going to rate this one? Again, it's a no bo uh, no boner, no brainer. It's five out of five again for Rocky Free. So, there you have it. There is my review on the third Rocky movie. Have you seen it? Let me know all that down below in the comments. And if you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and to share with your friends. And feel free to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you like horror content, I have a channel for that too linked down below with my social media links and stuff. So yeah, I've been Random Ross. This has been a random review. And until next time, I bid you all a goodbye. Goodbye.